I want to show you this cool progression. I'm going to show you how you can apply it in a song, but it's a really cool movement that you can, um, I'm in the key of G today. But uh, you could also use this movement in any other key. But I'm using G just for this example right here. Um, I use the numbers, so if you're not that well versed in the number system, check out some of my, my courses that I have on the number system so you can understand the language and the ideology that I'm using. Um, so the movement's going to be two, three, four, I'm going to play a six, and then five. So I'm going to play it, I'll have you in the example, but those are going to be the main numbers. Half diminished. Flat diminish. So when I'm doing that moving right there, I'm using the B string to work on that melody. second down to the first or go from the second position to the first bit with a diminish now I'm going to show you how we can apply it to the song I'm going to the song that I'm going to use to apply it to is a song called uh, lessons by Eric Robertson here we go God has a funny way of showing what is example that I'm using for this particular song I want to show you like there's a couple other movements that we can do around it so and then I do like a movement off of the six using those triads ideas that you can use and add to your playing but this is a cool exercise really for more of my advanced intermediate advanced or kind of on that cusp if you're a beginner you want to try to figure it out definitely rewind it a bunch of times and just kind of work through it but that's the example you can use it with that song but you can use that same movement with other particular r songs that kind of have that same kind of feel this one particular movement is just to show you how you can use it and apply it to other songs that feel and sound the same way <laughs>